Rather Forest Tutorials for Beginners. Rather Forest is one of the best planning platforms which you can use to create high quality designs, okay? For videos, logos, graphics, mockups, and websites, okay? So, first thing you have to do is to sign up using your Facebook account or your um, Google account, okay? You can also sign up using your um, email, okay? You can sign up using your email. So, once you've signed up, this will be your render for us, okay? So the first thing you'll do is you go ahead and create a video. Today I'll be creating a video, okay? So you click on create video, okay? So when you click on create video, you can see the video template. So you select any of the video template that you need. But today I'll be create, um, creating, um, you can see on, on the category section, I'll be creating an animation video. Under animation video, I'll be creating explainer videos, right? So when you click on that, you can see all the um, explainer video template that you can use for your design. So I'll be um, I'll be going with this um, one. I'll be, create, I'll be going with this one. Let me insert this on my. Um, let me insert this. Okay, for it now. All right. Okay. I've I've selected my um, first first I've selected my explainer video. So now you'll be left with three options. Okay. You can add scene. You can load a preset, or you can type your script. Okay. To type your script, what you have to do is you type the script that you have. Okay. And when that for us to make a video for you. But this most especially when you don't have a um, lot of time, okay? So, but today I'll be going ahead, ahead to create a scene, okay? But if you, if you like to load a preset, here you choose from ready-made stories, okay? You can choose from ready-made stories, then go ahead and use it, okay? When you click on load a preset, Florida Forest has already made stories that you can use for your design, okay? But today, I will go ahead and add scene, okay? So, I can create my own scene step by step, okay? So, here you can select any of the places that I need, okay? I'll be selecting this, okay? The happy man with me. So, I'll select this. I will insert that on my... Um, I will insert that on my design, okay? So, let's... Um, wait for that to load. Okay, you can see I've successfully inserted my design. So I will add another preset. Okay, um, this time I'll be um, I'll select or add. Um, let's say logo. All right, so I'll go ahead and add a website, Gmail number, icons, and the rest of them, okay? I'll select that and click on Add, right? I'll insert that on my project, okay? So, that's it, okay? On this section, you can add text, okay? For the text, you can, um, let me say, let me type which web design um, services, right? can see it will be shown on the screen okay and those changes will be, be saved okay so when the forest auto saves your work so any change that you make it will be saved automatically okay so that's for it okay on this section you get to um, choose the 3d format that you like okay you can leave this as this format while you can slide over to use this look for your design okay but um, I'll go ahead and use uh, the 3D look, okay? So this other one is to choose the color presets, okay? That I like to use, okay? So when you click on the secondary text, you, the color presets will be listed out for you. So you can see, what you have to do is to select any of the presets that you like for your design, okay? But I think um, I'll go ahead and use this, okay? This, okay. 
so that's for it as for the music that's where you get to add music okay on the upload you can upload from, from your um, gallery or your file manager okay you can upload music from your device but render for us gives access to music that you can add on while designing your um, project so you can click on add music to add any music of your choice okay so that's it once you've done that you can then come over to the um this section to continue your editing okay so for the second slide we are going to add a new text okay for this test you can um add the first test what are we going to add for first step okay uh, firstly on the on your logo here you can choose to add logo you can upload logo from your media gallery or from your device okay you can also create logo by yourself or you can add text or image url whatever you feel like adding okay so that's for it okay that's for it but for now i'm gonna cancel that okay for the first one you have to add your website okay www.richieweb design.com okay once you have done that you click and save okay for your gmail you can add info okay okay you save and close okay for your phone number you can add your mobile number okay you can see that as simple as that okay that's simple as that once you're done with your changes you can preview when you preview you can proceed and export your videos okay but let me go ahead and show you a lot of um, templates or other features that you can use while designing your project okay there are a lot of features on this application too okay so let me go back to the home page okay so that's it very well um this is our home page okay and you can also choose to create your logo okay if you would like to create a logo simply click on make logo okay when you make logo you can include the name of your logo let's say Richie web design okay that's my brand my brand i'll click on get logo okay when you click on get logo you wait for render forest to um, process it okay the tag like can um, say um, um, home of skills okay as the tag line okay this is what i'm going to use for you can add description okay but i'll go ahead and ignore that okay so you can choose any of these presets okay you can choose any of the preset that you need okay you can choose any of these presets but today i'll be using this and then you click on next okay when you click on next you wait for it and for us to process it okay you can see these are a lot of logos that you can use okay so you can go ahead and click or select any of the logo you're interested in getting when you select you click on edit and download okay so that's how to go about it okay it's very fast and easy the next step is to if you like to create mock-up mock -up files when you click on mock-up, you can search or choose any mock-up that you need for your design, okay? When you click on any mock-up that you need, so you can go ahead and choose any of these templates, then edit the lines, okay? It's very easy, okay? With the use of drag and drop, you can easily edit your templates, okay? So, that's how you go about it, okay? But let's wait for this to apply, okay? Good. You can see the file is still loading. Very well. You can see how the templates looks like. Okay, so you can go ahead and edit these templates. Okay, customize and edit them. Okay, so that's how you go about the website section. Okay, you can also design graphics. Okay? You can design graphics by clicking on the graphics section. Okay, when you click on design graphics, you can design any graphics I want okay, for your logo for your flyers your whatever it is okay you can design your graphics section on this 
particular um, aspects okay so that's what you need to know about that okay so that's how you can use um, rental forest as a beginner okay if you're a beginner this is how you can use this render for us to edit your projects or work on any projects of your choice okay so if you find this video helpful please click on the subscribe button like comment and tell me what you think about the video okay so that's it thank you very much and be blessed peace